I'm really excited to, to jump into uh, the specifics of what we're going to talk about with your time with me today. And that's five principles of real estate wealth building. The first principle of real estate wealth building, and in my opinion, the most important one, if you get this one wrong, don't even go to number two, seriously. The number one principle is cash flow is king, or in my case, cash flow is queen. Uh, the reason this is the most important is because, well, if it doesn't cash flow, then it's not a good investment, right? Uh, I learned this lesson the hard way. Uh, when I first started um, buying property, I got caught up in the hype of the real estate boom in South Florida, and I ended up making the mistake of purchasing properties uh, banking on appreciation and not thinking about cash flow. I also didn't plan on holding them for a long time. I thought that I would flip those properties. Well, when the real estate party came to an end, I was stuck with all these properties that I couldn't sell because they were worth less than what I owed on the mortgages and they didn't cash flow. And that happened to a lot of people. It's actually one of the reasons for the real estate crash is people are just walking away from properties in droves because they couldn't afford to pay the mortgage and they owed more on the property than it was now worth, causing a value free fall in real estate across the country. Now, I learned my lesson the hard way. I call it failing forward and I only invest in properties that cash flow now. If it doesn't cash flow, and it doesn't have a value add opportunity where I can rehab it, invest in the property, and immediately make it cash flow after the rehab is done, I won't look at it, pure and simple. It must cash flow. Cash flow, cash flow, cash flow. 